Uh, 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 u
Be Donald Trump and niggas, man. Straight the fuck up. Oh, and man. If a nigga don't want to rap, man, we got jobs for niggas. You can stand on stage and hold the water bottles. Black cat. Wipe the sweat off my forehead or some shit, you know what I'm saying? Send you out in the crowd to grab bitches, something like that, man. We'll give you a job, man. Oh, Help money. Man. Anything, you know what I mean? Oh. Selling them records, man. They all over the street. Yeah, he ain't got one of our CDs, man. I don't know where the fuck you been at. Kill yourself. Yeah, you been in the penitentiary and shit. Niggas in, and niggas in there even got the shit on their iPods. They sneaking in that bitch. <laughs> shit, there's more us in the street than drugs right now, man. Man, I'm right. I would pull the clap out. Just let niggas know I ain't clean, man. Like I said, I'm on tape. I can't be doing all that. Y'all yeah, should exhale right now. Exhale. Well, yeah, niggas might take that shit to my PO. Like, look, I got him. Fuck that shit. For Rocco. <laughs> yeah, Rocco type niggas. Man. Oh, good. Yeah, I don't want to say no names. Yeah, we ain't gonna do that. But you got a no book. Got a no book, man. Nigga, want to act up, man? We're leaving, man. Straight up. Oh, man. How we doing it, man? 2010, 2011, man. Gonna get ugly for artists, man. Cause I mean, Fresh Deck, we don't got no affiliation with nobody, man. We not tied in to nobody. You know what I'm saying? If, if you not with us, you competition. Friend, enemy, brother, sister, it doesn't matter, man. Aunt, uncle, mom, dad. If you not rocking with us, you not rocking with us, man. We not headlining shows with underminers and all that shit on the ticket. We doing our shows, man. If somebody open up for me and Nova, that you on Fresh Deck Records, man. We not playing, man. We not about to let niggas throw dirt on us, man. You know what I'm saying? We not about to have people thinking that these lame ass niggas is affiliated with us when they really not, man. I don't, I don't even like that shit, man. Whack rub off on niggas. You know what I mean? We tough on them, man. Don't nothing stick to us, man. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, man, if you ain't fresh deck families, man, you competition. Really, y'all aren't competition, but y'all are. You know what I'm saying? Y'all what we up against. It's light work, but it's work. You know what I mean? So, this shit that's about to start happening, man, don't feel no type of way about it, man. It's, just per it's not personal, it's business. You know what I'm saying? So, Mr. City, okay. So, tell the people a little bit about yourself. How'd you come up, how'd you come up with the name City? I'm the prince of this motherfucker, man. So when did you start rapping? Damn rapping. I've been doing this forever, man. And like, your, your style is so, so finesse, you know? It's like, it's like you, you do it without even thinking. How, how do you do it? How do you perfect your style to a lot of these artists out here that's trying to perfect their styles? I give them me, man. Niggas is pump fakers, man. They just ain't. And don't never let the ball go. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Niggas pump fake, man. If you if you rap in your life, you should have to think about it. You know what I mean? It should be no thinking. It should just be. It should just come out. Soon every time you open your mouth, it should come out your fucking mouth. Okay, okay. So for a lot of these rappers who who watch this right here and they say, okay, I I should hit him up. I got bars for him. You know I mean, he probably scared or he ain't. You know, he don't want to fuck up his career. What you got to say to them? What you mean? Like if a guy call you out or if an artist or rapper call you out and they want to battle, how do you feel about that? I mean, are you too, like, focused on what you're doing to, to you know, you can't, you don't have the time of day for these type of people or would you tell, they at, tell them a new asshole per se? I mean, a nigga got to eat, right? True. All right. Yeah. It's like appetizers, man. I'm just waiting for one of these industry niggas. Yeah, I heard I'm waiting on the main course, man. These local rappers, they appetizers, man. I eat them first, man. You so, know what I'm saying? As far as like the industry, because I know it's, you know, it's a lot of, a lot of labels, a lot of speculation, a lot of rumors going around about who we going to and, you know, who uh who we should get signed to? What's your thoughts on the matter? Like, who do you think we should get signed to, or who would you be cool with going with, or who would be your first pick? Like, just your thoughts on the matter. Probably the strongest team out there right now, man. Young Money, they doing it. 
Y'all heard it first. Yeah, we what they missing, man. They 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 got a lot of artists, man. They're strong, man. But they don't got no real niggas. You feel me? They they got niggas, you know what I'm saying? They got a strong ass team and shit. They got Drake be doing his fucking thing. You know what I'm saying? Wayne laying it down. They got Nikki Tiger. You know what I'm saying? Corey Guns, Jay Mills, all them niggas, man. Dude. More, man. My credibility match up, man. My resume is right. My paperwork is good, man. That shit is public record, man. Get on the internet and read it, man. You know what I'm saying? Spares came for us. We had guns for them niggas, you know what I'm saying? So it was like, nigga, check my paperwork. That's all I can say, man. My credibility is straight, man. And a lot of these artists in the industry right now are suspect, man. You know what I'm saying? So, so uh, we were, we say we wasn't going to say no names, so I'm going to just kind of pump thinking with this question. Uh, how do you feel about um, people who who call themselves or being called uh, Mr. West Virginia, or so to speak? I mean, anybody could be Mr. West Virginia, but how do you feel? Like, do you think? Do you feel that there's a Mr. West Virginia? Me. There you have it. I mean, shit. What the fuck am I supposed to say? You know what I mean? Like, In the flesh. Niggas ain't ready, man. Tell them niggas set they shit up, man. Like, like I said, man. I shit on niggas' flows and crush and flush careers down toilets, man. Oh. You know, like, <laughs> they don't. Man, it ain't too many niggas out here that want to see me, man. And if you do want to see me, get your bread up. I mean, uh, I got 2,500 fast sets, 2,510, whatever you want to go for. We can do that. It's not that. Call me. My number is 304-993-6020. If you got your bread together, call me, man. And we can do it, man. It's nothing. Yeah, I heard it at first. A real street nigga. A real street nigga. Nigga buy this money shit. We can put some blocks on. Okay, so one more question before we go. Three hundred zannies to the stomach. What, what? <laughs> <laughs> Do we deck him out? <laughs> man, do we? Oh, all these niggas and bitch, man, these motherfuckers bunch of young junkies, these days, man. What the fuck, man? I went to prison, man. We was smoking weed and drinking Heineken's, man. I come home, these motherfuckers popping O.C., Zane. Oh, my gosh. The fucking right around this bitch looking like fiends, man. What the fuck, man? Bitches was thick, come home, they skinny. <laughs> Niggas was getting money, come home, they broke. What the fuck? Niggas was walking around looking like fucking zombies, man. It's bad, man. And I give any one of these niggas three other to the stomach, man. So they so basically what the state needs is they they need somebody to come and help them out, come and pick them up, cause they don't got they don't got nobody to lean on right now. Shit, I'm the clean up hitter, man. There you go. He's the clean. Y'all y'all heard it here first. You heard it here first, man. Fresh Deck TV.